you know, it was like people run to what they want or they run from who they don't want to be. be. Yeah, and I was running from who I didn't want to be anymore because yeah. I hated that guy. This is life changing. This is truly life changing. <laughs> I mean, I have holes in the way that I communicate and my goal is to get the message across to as many people as possible that they can have this, this life for them yeah. and their family. Um, but I know I'm missing something. Yeah, right? well, well, we're all missing something. So like, and, and, but you're always in search for it. And I think that's why you're growing so fast. Can I be really candid? Like, yeah. I mean, we've been talking here, been hanging yeah, out. Yeah, the cold hard truth is what I yeah, tell no, everybody but, in this world. So I think. Um, but it's not always easy to share, and it's not always easy to hear. And, and and I'll back up by saying some of the hardest things to get out of are a success trap. Mm. Dude, five years ago you were a car salesman, and now you have a hundred employees. You have a nine-figure business. You're impacting people all over the world. What, 100 million people watch mm. your videos on a regular basis. I don't know if that's monthly or 50 million. It's insane. So. The reason I'm pre-framing that is because what you're doing is building something that most people can't, right? So what I'm about to say could be like, whatever, whatever, Dean, like don't, I went from zero to nothing. Like, Don't, don't feed me ice but, cream. I want the truth for but sure. But I have to tell you, so I've seen your videos. I, I told you this. I'm not telling you this for the first time, but I've seen your videos and a couple people say, this Andy Elliott, man, he's, he's doing real evaluation. I, I watch some of your videos and um, best sales training I've ever seen hammering people like getting right after them in a way that I think this world has been lacking for a while. Like you're not politically correct. You, you don't hold back. Hey guys, I would love to personally invite you to come train out with me. I'm gonna be coached by my coach, Tony Robbins and Dean Graciosi, June 13th, 14th, and 15th, right here in Scottsdale, Arizona. All you have to do is have trained with me at least on a training course before. So if you're watching this, if you've purchased one of my training courses before, you qualify for this. By the way, it's free. It doesn't cost you any money. It's absolutely free. So what does that mean? That means if you're watching this and you've trained with me, I'm not gonna charge you anything. I want you to come train with me. I want you to come out to Scottsdale, Arizona. You're gonna train with me while I get coached from my coach, Tony Robbins and Dean Graciosi. It's gonna be three days straight. This room is gonna be filled with about 500 people that are raging fans of what the LA Group stands for, is the core values, the standards, and winning and kicking ass. And if that's you, you're gonna be with these like-minded people and you're gonna be with me while I coach. I love you guys. It's something that I've never done before, but it's a private invite for those who have trained with me. So if you wanna to come to this, just text the number 918-210-02. Two five four. Write it down. It's very simple. 918-210-0254. Shoot me a text. Say, hey, Andy, my name's John Watson. I did buy your training course, you know, a year ago. I would love to come train with you on these three days with you and your company while you're getting coached. I'd love to spend that time with you. If that's you, boom, we'll send you over an invitation. It's limited seating, only 450 to 500 people, and then we're cutting it off. Let's get back to the video. And then a couple people came and said, do you know Andy's story? Like he, he got your stuff years ago and he talks amazing about it. Like you gotta meet this guy. And by the third time someone said, you should meet Andy. And I knew you were here in Scottsdale. Um, I said, all right, we, sh we should connect with this guy. And before I did, I watched a couple extra videos and I called a couple people. And a buddy of mine, somebody we both know, said, seems like a good guy, man, but I was at an event and he's really harsh on some people. Mm -hmm. Right, like I watched him on stage. He had a guy take his shirt off, kind of embarrassed the dude. And he's like, he inspired a lot of people, but I feel like he might've crushed some souls. And I heard this most amazing man, best trainer. And I heard some of that. And what my wife and I always do is we're going to take it for what we think. So I, I'm just going to share that with you. I love it. So that's why you're my coach. I was half like, should I go to dinner? Or should I not? I just want to be honest with you. And I'm like, let's go. We go to dinner. And I'm completely, I, I just, you gotta hear this, completely blown away. Because I've been in this industry long enough and I've been, I've met a lot of people that, you know, sometimes you gotta watch when you meet your heroes, you hear that story, right? Mm -hmm. I've said this before, the guy that's teaching people how to be in relationships, yelling at his spouse, or the guy teaching, you know, personal development is mean to other, like, you just gotta watch behind the scene. I didn't know what to expect. And I show up and, I, and this guy that's, flirting with his wife, can't keep his hands off his wife, can't stop talking about his kids, can't stop talking about the impact you want to make on the world, that it's not you about, about you anymore, it's about them. Like everything, like I, I was just blown away. I sat there with my mouth open. I was pinching my wife under the table. I'm like, 
is a guy that freaking cares at the deepest level. And this is a hard one because what you're doing in the, like you shouldn't stop what you're doing because you're, you showed me the numbers. You're growing a million people a month, people following you and they're being inspired. We came here today, I brought my son and his friend, his friend follows you. Like how amazing is that? So for me to say this could, but I, I believe that people got to see more of that other side of you. I just, I don't think you scare away a guy that wants the, you know, the, the driver, the David Goggins type feel of like, let's just effing do this, no stop, this is my man, make me do it, I'm gonna lose away. I want you to inspire that. But I would say in between that, I think people need to see the man you've become. And you've also been transparent with me and talked about your past and the man you used to be is dead and the man you are today. And I truly, I want you to know, I truly see it. I, I think my wife's got the best bullshit meter of any human I've ever met. We got done with dinner. She's like, there are people we could, like, I believe everything he said and what his wife said and I, and I still feel that way. But I think the, the only thing I'd say is be careful when you inspire the majority, but there's a small majority that feel I could never be that man. I can never mm -hmm. be Andy Elliott. I'm never gonna have a six pack. I'm never gonna be able to work that hard. I'm never gonna be that good on the phone because that person might just go into the abyss going, that's too much for me. And I think if you just shift a little, when that guy's go, I, I could get emotional thinking about that person because you can think about the guy that goes, man, this group, look at all these guys that work for them. They're all looking good. They're, in a, they're ripped in their black shirts. And there's a small group that are going, I'm good, man, I'm good. And uh, I don't know why I get emotional with stuff like this, but I think that's the group with just a little shift. The man that I saw at dinner, you stop and go, wait a minute. And you go over and you grab that guy and say, no, you're in here too. Mm. You belong here too, bro. You belong here too. When you get that, I, I don't know if your business is gonna grow, man, but you're gonna grow. And, and I, think, I think there's no stopping you. That's crazy. Yeah, when my, my life changed, uh, I remember I got pissed off because I hated who I was. <clears throat> So I think uh, you call it a success trap. Yeah. Getting upset and, you know, controlled anger, right? Like, ah, I'm gonna get this. Um, that, that I, I wasn't alive, I felt like I was dead. And then when I felt that, it made me feel alive. Cause like we're human beings, I have these feelings. And I'm like, that's what allowed me to catapult forward. That momentum, I kept building from yeah. that. I don't wanna be, you know, it's like people run to what they want or they run from who they don't, don't want to be. be. Yeah, and I was running from who I didn't want to be anymore because yeah. I hated that guy. And so like, I feel like, I think I just try to, I need to be more, not be so one dimensional. Yeah, and, and please don't, I, there, there's people watching right now saying, Dean, shut up. I love Andy exactly the way is kick my ass man be the boots you know the the drill sergeant right and and most of us need that so please no i'm not trying no, to make you heart. soft yeah but you can heart. be that guy that hard drill sergeant the man you are that get people to take that action mm -hmm. and also if I, I just could feel a little bit of that heart that i got to see i think mm -hmm. there's another group of people that go oh yeah this guy's for me too yeah we, we built our team and we built our loyalty and we built everything we had just by showing people more love than they've ever gotten from anything. I, but in this I world. see it here. Yeah, I see it here, and I know I see it in your videos. So please, and I haven't watched a million of your videos. Oh, yeah. But I just think you could you but could have intent, a little bit of more of that. Yeah, I agree. Like wearing my heart on my sleeve. Yeah. And making sure that you know, I understand that we're all in different places, and uh, you know, it's just yeah. Don't stop being you, man. Just add a little extra. So do you think it's like, it's like if I have a hundred percent intensity, right? Yeah. Is it like 50%? Yeah, so like if, yeah, if it was like, if this is you on stage, right? And I've watched you on stage now a couple times because we were at similar events. And this is what you do from here to here, right? And your level of intensity is 100% all the way. I don't think you shift any of that, Okay. right? But I think there's moments that you will feel like, and I don't, it just, it happened over time for me. Like there are moments where I'll be on stage and I feel like I'm connected with 90% of the audience and something in my brain goes, you're missing some people, bro. Mm. You're, you're leaving them behind. And, and I, instead of giving you some formula, 19 minutes in, you should, I think as you're, you're in this feel and you wanna just jack them up and you want them to take action, I would look around and find the guy that you could tell is like, I can't, like, and just talk to him for just 1%. Just talk to him for me. Like stop in the middle of your thing and just think of that guy and go, I also know I get a little intense. I know I get intense. I know I'm fired up, but my heart is to serve and this is the only way I know how to serve. 
And I want to serve you too. Yeah, you. I want you with me too. I'm not too much for you. I'm not too far distant from you. I had feelings just like you. And just think of that, mm. that maybe just a few times, be you, be you, be you, be you. But in these couple of moments, I think, I think you're going to fall Don't in love with it. Don't leave anybody out. I just think you're going to fall in love with it. And you're going to watch yeah. somebody who is like, this guy's a little much, or his eyes are down, or she's her eyes are down, they can't do it. And you're going to watch them light up. Talk about addicting. Then you'll, then, then you'll find your groove. I don't want, I'm not trying to make you me. That, I have my style, you have yours, you know? Yeah, this is good. Hey guys, first of all, I know that some of you are watching this right now and um, this is life changing. This is truly life changing. Some people need a little more of my intensity and they, they run do. this way all the time, right? And so it would be reverse. Absolutely. Right? Um, everybody has a hole. This hole right do. here, this hole right here, I, I, I preach my message, which is just raise your standards, human excellence, you know, be a better person, be a better father, be a better husband, be a better business leader. You do. Um, you know, and I watch be, it with your be tribe. Your, you do that with your whole tribe. Yeah, be better to your, your community. But, you know, maybe I haven't earned the right to sometimes be that intense yet. So if it's somebody that's new yet, if they don't know I have that side, um, even though that what I have may be amazing for them, um, they won't even hear me because I'm not connecting. Yeah, and, and you know that, that saying that sometimes the reason you're the, who you are is because you know what they need. You know it because you were there. You know mm -hmm. what you needed when you told me the story that your wife didn't look at you the same, that you stopped working out, you'd have been in shape your whole life and you were just letting yourself go. You said when you came home, Jackie got crumbs, not food, mm -hmm. right? Not leftovers, like leftover time, crumbs no of energy, your time, no, no energy. You were tired. You thought you were just getting old, right? So you know they need Andy at 100% intensity to just shake them and vibrate. True? Yeah. Sometimes people don't do what they need. They do what they want. Mm. Right? It's like, but I, I want to go easier into this. I don't know if I could go all in and I don't know if I can do better with my wife and better at the gym and better at all. I, I, don't, I, I, I don't need all that. I, I, just need, I just need a little, right? No, they need all of you, man. Hmm. But sometimes you sell people what they want so then you can get them into your world and give them what they actually need. How much do I owe you? <laughs> <laughs> I love you, bro. You got it, man. Thank you, man. This you is going to help me go to a whole new level, man. This is Andy Elliott 3.0. You got it. These are just subtle things along the way, right? Hey guys, I just want to tell you you're the true one percenters. You made it till the end of the video. Do me a favor, share it with the friend that wants to go to another level. Make sure you like the video, comment below so I know who you are. Set your notifications and then subscribe to the channel. We got daily sales training videos dropping. I'll see you soon.